Mr. and Mrs. Consumer, do you ever feel that things are out of control? Don't let the flu catch you. Immunization's the best way to protect yourself and your loved ones from the flu. Even though the CDC says that it's, what, not even 50% effective? Over 65 million Americans experience bladder leakage. Nearly half are under age 50. Nearly one in four Americans may need a different kind of underwear between the ages of 20 and 85. Look who's come to your house to stay. A pal you can play with all day long. Bud, I'll find it. It's got to be in here someplace. Oh! Look at how these plastic bottles that are for sale of water are just sitting out baking in the sunlight. Do you think those are BPA-free bottles? The chemistry of plastics. You make plastic. Mold plastic. Play with plastic. Check out this vegetable steamer made out of some kind of stretchy plastic from China. It says BPA-free. Yeah, but a lot of the BPA-free stuff has estrogen mimickers anyway. I don't feel good about that. Really? Creamy peanut buttery granola dipped in chocolatey deliciousness. And now that there are more bars per box, there's enough for everybody. I just came to a Walgreens in the middle of the night because my kid hit his head and I was going to try and get him some kind of ibuprofen. And there's nothing here that you can get that is not filled with horrifying horrifying ingredients. Just petrochemicals up and down. This has butyl paraben, DNC red 33, FDNC blue 1, high fructose corn syrup because you know when you're trying to get your kid to rest that's a good one. It has the sodium benzoate and citric acid combination which we know forms a known carcinogen benzene when it's in a bottle. Half of this stuff I don't know what it is. This one's got carrageenan, butyl paraben, DNC red 33, FDNC blue 1, high fructose. Even the ones that are supposedly dye free, that are supposed to be better and have, this one's actually for infants, it's filled with stuff too. The chewable version is not even any better. In fact, it's almost worse, I think. There's not one safe option on this shelf. And the second word is in our secret code. The first word is watch. Corn oil, cottonseed oil, palm oil, soybean oil, sunflower oil, six. The fact is, why don't they know? I've eaten way too many seasoned curly fries in my day. I'm glad those days are behind me. I don't remember a label, but that's a lot of kinds of vegetable oil. The fact that they don't know which, what's actually in there. It could be canola oil, but it could also be corn oil. Might be cottonseed oil, totally genetically modified like the corn. Could be soybean oil, also totally genetically modified. Might be palm oil, maybe less genetically modified. Could be sunflower oil. We don't really know. We just have a big vat of leftover industrial waste stuff that we call vegetable <laughs> oil. Margarine. And not one customer noticed. Same buttery flavor. Because the best way to protect yourself from the flu isn't to just eat better, make sure you're up on your vitamins, boost your immune system. The best way to protect yourself from the flu is really to inject yourself with a cocktail of chemicals that includes heavy metals. That's the smartest idea to protect yourself from the flu. Why is this a thing now that everyone is peeing themselves? You cannot tell me this is normal. Millions of Americans are doing just that. They eat well, but wisely. I want to know what your thoughts are specifically on mozzarella cheese type flavor. My thoughts are, how does this possibly need two columns for ingredients? How fine is that print going to get? <laughs> what kind of banquet is this? Allergic living. Wow. Would this have even been a thing 50 years ago? That's why things go better with Coke after Coke after Coke. Wait, I know that you're getting gas right now and you really need to fill up, but how would you like a flu shot with that right now? The gas pump turns into a needle and you can get injected with pure health right away. Bewitchingly beautiful. Look who 
wants a lift. John is obviously not telling the truth because we've been told it's Jen over. is dumped and it's over. And yet we've been told they're finally married. <laughs> what is the no, truth? No, it's over. It's over. She was dumped hours before her dream wedding. The younger woman, the final fight, devastated and furious. Who is trying no. to deceive the public oh, and the support information? It's the best day of her life. And what is the real truth? <laughs> I leave it to you.